1994 was without a doubt one of Sonic the Hedgehog's best years. Fans had both Sonic 3 and Sonic and & Knuckles to play, and Sega teamed with McDonald's for one of the franchise's most memorable food promotions. Well, 1995 wasn't a repeat when it came to successful games, Sorry Tales and Knuckles spin-offs, we did see another iconic Sonic food promotion taking place. Hedgehog pasta new from Franco American. Good. What are you playing for lunch? It sounds silly, but Franco American Sonic the Hedgehog pasta was my holy grail when it came to collecting Sonic food items. Unlike most other Sonic food promos, an empty or even full can of Sonic pasta is not something many people held on to. I know back in 1995 I ate my fair share of these, but never once thought, I should hold on to this, I could sell it for $20 on eBay someday. Thankfully, the one I recently got was empty. Had it been full, the can would have likely leaked, ruining the label, or I would have to witness the horror that is 20-year-old canned pasta. Just check out DinosaurDracula.com's article on opening a 1991 can of Ninja Turtles pasta. Some food history. Franco American began as a company in the late 1800s and was soon bought out in 1915 by the Campbell Soup Company. As the years went on, fewer products were marketed under the Franco American name, with Campbell's preferring their own name for soups. Up until 2004, Franco American was almost exclusively pastas, including spaghettios and gravy. However, since 2004, most Franco American products have shifted over to Campbell's though a small Franco-American logo can still be found on the back of Campbell's pasta products, and apparently the brand is still used in parts of Canada. Sonic's history with Franco-American was surprisingly long, with the aforementioned 1995 pasta in both meatball and no meatball varieties, as well as a 1996 variation on the pasta which featured a game piece for the Sega Scratch and Scream Stakes contest. Sean! Sonic the Hedgehog Pasta, new from Franco-American. Good. Now you can play the sweepstakes where everyone wins. The Sonic Scratch and Scream Stakes. Cool. Prizes like Game Gear, your own Sega game station. Very cool. Under labels of new Sonic the Hedgehog Pasta, everyone wins instantly. I won. I won! To play with a purchase by Sonic Scratch and Scream Stakes, PO Box 656, Servo, New Jersey, 08871. Given the promotion called for kids to peel off the label and scratch the game piece, I'm going to guess that these 1996 cans are even harder to find. While I'm not certain the pasta existed in 1997 or 1998, it did see a facelift in 1999-2000, featuring Sonic Adventure art and an offer for a free Archie Sonic comic. Interestingly, it looks like the pasta shapes went unchanged. You'd think the pasta artisans at Franco-American would want another crack at capturing Tails' likeness. After another label change, the Franco-American and Sonic partnership ended. But you can still relive the taste of Sonic pasta in 2016. Campbell's continues brand partnerships with their meatballs and pasta products. SpaghettiOs Meatballs Super Mario and Sonic the Hedgehog Meatballs ingredients are incredibly similar, and there is no mistaking that look and smell. But how about the taste? Still disgusting. I wouldn't have it any other way. See you next time on Fastest Food Alive. More Sega and Sonic history can be found at segabits.com. And also, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and check us out on all major social networks.